I'm Gary Zimmer, uh, Midwestern BioEgg is the company I've been developed and worked with the last 35 years. My family also has a farm in southwestern Wisconsin. We're Hotter Creek Organic Farms and we farm about 1,500 acres and have a small dairy herd and cash crop. I got interested and involved with soils to create better feed for dairy cows. I'm a dairy nutritionist. And we started looking at nutritional value and quality and limiting factors and realizing that there was other elements available. We got involved with putting on soluble calciums. We started looking at trace minerals and we started testing feeds and cows performed better and we had better, healthier, higher yielding crops. And we started paying attention to phosphorus uptake, available calcium, higher calcium levels in the plant boron and magnesium those four minerals if i look at a feed test or a tissue test on any crop if there are really high uptakes of those four minerals it'll be the highest best quality crop you'll ever grow so the boron really affects calcium uptake and sugar translocation to get magnesium uptake you can't overdo potassium and you're going to have to use sulfur and to get phosphorus uptake you can dump all you want onto the soil, but to get phosphorus uptake, you're gonna need a little biology, a little mycorrhizae fungus. So monitoring those four minerals really changed your crop. Now, always the minerals that we would like to add, we look at sources and we're dry blenders or fertilizer, but trace minerals are also very valuable and critical for plant, many plant functions. If you wanna to go to the next level in production, you better pay attention to them. Some farmers say, well, you just added my cost. And I said, no, I wanna switch your costs. Instead of putting on more insecticides, fungicides, and pesticides, why not switch to healthier nutrition into the plant and get higher levels of trace minerals, higher levels of calcium. You'll actually get rid of some of your issues that you're spending money on now that never make your farm better. And so that's how, because us farming organically, we don't have those tools. So everything is prevention. And so as we got involved in this thing, that's what it really drove the whole thing. I work with any kind of a farm you can possibly imagine in production and size. And, and they're not certainly there's some organic, but most of them are not. And um, I was just out in California. It's amazing the things they're trying to do out here to get plants healthy because they're going to be forced not to use some of these compounds that they've been using. So I think balanced nutrition and, and monitoring your plants and, and looking at things you haven't been looking at. And of course, we're real big on rotations and cover crop and shallow incorporating residues and running deep rippers to make sure the water soaks in and there's all kinds of things you can do to make farming better and that's what I've been involved with.